Maitokobi gave the charge on Monday during the National Executive Council meeting of the Association of the Artin Headquarters in Abuja. He also explained why the association wouldn't endorse any candidate ahead of the presidential elections despite overthrow by several political parties. Our members are everywhere, 774 local governments throughout the Federation. So today I'm using this medium to send message across the Federation that any member of Road Transport Employees Association of Nigeria, anywhere you found yourself, don't be allowed to be used for any touting, hooliganism, etc., etc., because Retians members were a law abiding citizen and will not allow any one of our members to involve himself in any trouble. The state chairmen, secretary, treasurers throughout the federation, they make sure they call their members in every state to address them. They should not allow themselves to be used in any form of toggery or crisis. At the same time, the state chairmen, they should also call the chapters and address them to let them know we need peace in this country. Thank you and God bless all of you. Meanwhile, the national zonal and state leaders of our ten passed a vote of confidence on May Tokobi for what they describe as purposeful and satisfactory leadership of the association since he assumed office. All the zonal chairmen, leaders and intellectual leaders of the organization that we want the continuity of our able and wealthy leader, our executive national president, Dr. Alaji Musa Muhammad, may it will be one to continue, to continue as our president come the next election. He's our sole candidate, our sole candidate, our sole candidate. We know we are close to you and we know how you feel. We are putting a lot of bondage on you to take the leadership. We are supporting him for the second time. I stand. We are still expecting him to do more. That is why we are here. Me, I call him the mover and checker. The state chairman, secretary and treasurer on my respectable state in my zone agree to endorse Executive National President for Continuity is. We don't have any option than to endorse him as the sole candidate yes. of the forthcoming election. In Abuja, Jenny Mashagaya, Liberty News.